Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today's video we are talking baby hacks and the things you need to know to make your life easier as a mama to a little one. I'm not gonna lie, the period between four to six months can be a little bit challenging, but hopefully these tips, Oakley's behind the camera, will help you not feel so stressed out. You know, just make life a little easier, right? <laughs> You're happy now. It's been a morning. Okay, let's hop right into it. Also, thank you to KiwiCo for sponsoring today's video. Let's hop into the hacks. If you are breastfeeding a baby past the age of three months, you need this trick. Once your baby becomes more aware of the world, they can get so distracted when they're nursing. This is when you need one of these teething necklaces. This is for you, not baby. This is just a basic one I found on Amazon so I could try it out with Oakley, but there are so many cute options, especially on Etsy. You can find some really, really neat ones and I've already started a shopping card. You are going to wear this when you're nursing baby and it gives them something to play with. Even if you're not nursing, this is a great thing to have if you just need something to help distract baby or to teeth on. If they've dropped their teeth on the floor for like the hundredth time, you got them. Because I don't know about you, but when I breastfeed my baby, he is pulling my hair, he's scratching my skin, he's twiddling the other side. If you know, you know. And this just helps keep him focused on the job. Not to mention if there's any other noises going on in the room, he is like, it's just like so much harder to nurse lately. This is something you can just wear and kind of forget about, but it's there when you need it. When it comes to baby clothes, things can get really messy and disorganized quickly. You also don't want to lose track of where all the sizes are. Also, if there's more than one person in the household changing baby, you want to make sure that everyone knows where everything is going to be and you can just see everything when you're opening the closet or the drawer. So a couple things I like to do is number one, I keep sets together. So whether it's hung or folded, I always keep matching sets together so you know that this is a complete outfit. Trust me, it makes a huge difference, especially since I'm the one that usually buys the clothes. Matt doesn't always know like, oh, this sweater has a matching pair of pants to it. And if I want Oakley to look cute and coordinated, this is how I do it. The other thing I do is when it comes to the drawers, I like to do a file system. You know, like the Marie Kondo method. It works amazing for kids' clothes and it's easier because they're like little, so you don't have to like, you know, do, do as much folding. I get one of these insert drawer organizers. These are amazing, they're really affordable. And I fold the clothes in a file system so I can actually see everything in here. Otherwise, it can look like a going at a sale at a department store. Like, you know, where everything's just like toppled. It, it just gets crazy so fast. I like to organize all of his undershirts in one divider. I'll do pajamas in another one pants and another one. It just makes changing baby so much more efficient and quicker. You know where everything is. You go through so many outfits and changes in a day. So this just makes it so much less stressful. I'm so excited to be working with KiwiCo again. This is their Panda Crate subscription line that they carry for ages zero to 36 months. What's really great is you can actually go on their website and view each crate and see what is inside before ordering. I love them because they have purposely created research-backed toys and activities to help support your little ones growing and learning development. This is the Let's Discover box, which is great for exploring tactile play with your baby and helping them develop fine motor skills. There's different options you can choose from like the Panda Crate Plus, Panda Crate Essentials, and Panda Crate Deluxe. We have the Panda Crate Plus, which includes resources for parents, three to six play specific play items, and one grow with me toy. This here is my favorite part. It's the Wonder Play Guide. So it's a great resource for parents that you can see what everything is for. It also gives you some other helpful tips for the age that they're at and what they're going through. They are teaching your kids so many things, stimulating their five senses. I love that it's part of a subscription, so it automatically gets shipped to you. The Panda Crate specifically comes every two months, so I don't even have to think about it. It just arrives at my door. I love investing in high quality toys that are making a difference in my child's life. Check out KiwiCo today and save some money by using my code Nicole for 20% off your first crate. I'm going to have a link down below in the info box for you guys to check out. And honestly, I just think that this is one of the best parenting hacks and I want to include it in today's video. This is a hack my girlfriend actually told me about. She just had her first little boy and she told me one thing she was doing because he really didn't like going into the cold bassinet. Oakley's just on the bed was heating it up first with a heating pad. And this is just gonna ensure that your bassinet or your crib is at a nice warm temperature before baby goes in there. Especially if they just fell asleep in your arms, they're gonna be all warm and cozy. And as soon as you transfer them into their bed, they're gonna feel the temperature difference and possibly wake up. You know that feeling when you go into a bed and the sheets were just out of the dryer? Like that's the best feeling ever. Or like the towel warmers for when you're just out of the shower. This is what it is 
for babies. I think it's such a fun, easy hack, and this is something that you can use for you, period cramps, back aches, all the things that come during postpartum. It's multi-purpose, it's for mom and baby. So I'm gonna warm this up before Oakley's nap time. Disclaimer, you do not put your baby in with the heat warmer. You take the heat pad out and then you put baby in. I just, I feel like I need to clarify that. We're warming it up and then removing. <laughs> Nothing in bassinet with baby. I know this has happened to every single one of you guys watching. Your kid has a blowout, whether in their clothes or in a carrier, or this is the actual uh, like seat part to the saucer. And you just think, how am I gonna get this butternut squash stain out of the clothes? Let me tell you a trick. This is actually something my mom taught me after I had my first, and it was to use dish soap to get baby stains out. And I'm telling you, this gets everything out. You don't have to get anything fancy or toxic. I just get like a natural unscented dish soap. And I don't know if it's cause it cuts through grease and stuff, but it gets poop stains out. I've gotten out blueberry stains on my daughter's stuff. The trick is you want to scrub it out right away. Don't let it sit all day. Otherwise like it's, it might be a goner, but I have let things soak before and it still kind of works, but it's not like foolproof. Just squeeze out the water. I'm going to hang this to dry. I do this trick so often that I actually have a bottle of dish soap in the laundry room. It works that well. You welcome saving you on buying clothes for your kids. <laughs> okay. This one is kind of dependent on this high chair, but I know it's a popular one. And honestly, if you're shopping for one, this is the best one. It grows with your kid. My daughter started using it at six months and she is three and a half and still uses this. We're actually about to take this part off and just use it as a chair, but it's great because she can put her feet on it and she reaches the table. We love it so much. We actually bought another one for our son to use because he's starting solids in like two weeks. P.S. If you have not picked up a copy of the Baby Health Nut Cookbook, it is a complete recipe book with over 30 delicious home cooked recipes to feature little ones from the ages of six months and beyond. When I found out this hack, my mind was literally blown. I will link the TikToker I found this from down below because this is literally the coolest thing I've ever seen. Hashtag, you know, you're in your thirties when you get excited about stuff like this. If you have kids, you probably also have one of these hanging around. It's the popular Ikea drawer system for playrooms and stuff. If not, I think you just buy a single one too for replacements. Anyways, you use this, you're going to insert this into one of the grooves like a drawer. Also, you can buy lids for this and like utensil holders as well. Like I'm going to be adding to my collection. And you might be asking, why do I need a drawer under my kid's high chair? Let me tell you, this is where you're going to store all their food stuff. You got your suction plates in here, your bibs, you can put your utensils, your sippy cups, everything you need is right there in one place. Save space in the kitchen and it's ready to go when your toddler is ready for meal time. This is probably the best hack I ever seen. I was like, I have this, I have this, I'm gonna try it and it works. If your little ones are teething, you have to try one of these milk popsicles. All you have to do is pour some breast milk or formula in the little popsicle molds that it comes with, freeze it and then pop it in this little teether. Ooh, it's a fun little treat for them to also yeah. soothe their sore gums and it's literally just made out of breast milk. The soothing. The nice thing about this is you can also use it for them once they start solids. You can add things like fruit in there and it's a way for them to start to taste different foods without the risk of choking. Oh, it's dripping. We need a bib. He likes it. Mmm, baby's first popsicle. I don't want any. No, no thanks. No, thanks. When I tell you the hack with the heating pad in the crib completely knocked out Oakley for his nap, like you need to try that one. Also, let me know what your favorite hack of this video was down below. And don't forget to check out Kiwi Co. I'm gonna have them linked down below in the description box. Use my code Nicole for 20% off your first crate. Honestly, it is such a game changer with your kids. They will love it. There's something for every age and I can't wait for you guys to try them out if you haven't already. Thank you so much for watching. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed and if you want to see a toddler hacks video let me know down below as well i will see you guys in my next one subscribe and i will see you soon bye